Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Taurus July 8, 2022. You may be feeling a bit more in touch with your warrior side than you do with your emotional side today. More than likely, this will set the stage for conflict within your world of hopes and dreams. Be careful that you aren't being too aggressive towards people who are just trying to help you. The danger here is that you are most likely to hurt the ones who are closest to you, so be careful. Fascinating information and new ideas could come your way today. This could spark your imagination and spur you on to projects of your own which could take up a lot of your time and concentration right now. You are also likely to be looking and feeling especially sexy. An intimate encounter with your romantic partner would be a good idea at this time. This is also a great day to buy new clothes. Consider whether or not you're spending enough time with everyone that's special to you. If more hours are going toward work colleagues, or friends, or a romantic partner, there might be an imbalance that you need to take a look at. Sit down and create a pie on paper of where your time has gone lately based on waking hours. If one slice is considerably larger than the others, make a point of spending some time with whomever the smaller one represents. Today you might suddenly start receiving intense telepathic communications from someone you don't really know very well. This might be symptomatic of strong ESP, extrasensory perception, abilities on your part, or it might be that this person is sending out SOS signals to everyone he or she knows. If you feel comfortable with the idea, you might try to get to know him a little better. This person could need a friend right now. You are enjoying harmonious relations with family and friends. Take time for shared activities they will give you great pleasure. Occasions like this let you see what kind of person you are and the role you play amongst family and friends. What could be better than to find yourself in the company of others? This person has made eyes at you a few times, but something about it all still has you wondering. Is what you think going on really going on, or have you somehow misread things? Don't let how you're feeling pass you by, instead voice your romantic wishes, and tell others what you're willing to give and what is expected in return. Go out and make yourself noticed, be courageous. Find the person who is right for you and discover how you might begin to share wonderful times with another. Today you could be focused on the young people in your life. If you are a parent, you will have fun spending some quality time with your kids. Talk with them, offer them support, and see if they would like to play some sports with you. Or you could help them with their studies. If you have nieces or nephews, you could join them in a fun activity. If you want to get anything done on this day avoid contact with others as much as you can. However, it will be almost impossible for you to avoid some personal interaction with your own vibration in the air. Your love of socializing is renowned, and before you know it, a five-minute chat will turn into an hour. Perhaps it would be wise to lock yourself away until you finish the work on your plate. Just make plans for some fun this evening, to balance things out. You have much to offer someone, but you also have much to learn about what it means to be in a committed relationship. You cannot expect your partner to read your mind. Speak up if anything is bothering you. Your strategy of holding your tongue so as to avoid disrupting things only serves to make you angry and resentful. It takes confidence to say what is on your mind. Begin to cultivate that confidence now. Your partner can handle it. Just as Venus moves into her final 10 days in your income sector, the moon is wrapping up its monthly visit to your work sector. It was the moon's friendly aspect to Venus yesterday and to Saturn in your career sector before leaving today that will do more than leave you with an intuitive read on work and job matters. Over the last few days, this has helped to weave all the different threads together from across the income, work and career fronts, revealing something to be excited about. While the moon, returning for its monthly visit to your relationship sector will clash with Mars just days after his return to Taurus, the timing couldn't be better. This is stress testing a balance between your personal and relationship needs but just days after Mercury, the planet of communications returned to your communication sector and as support across the communication, friendship and relationship fronts has been building all week. Our eyes in the sky. 
The Libra moon forms a supportive aspect to Saturn early this morning, helping us set structures around our professional and romantic goals. However, a harsh aspect to healing asteroid Chiron a short time later threatens to challenge our energy level. The balance you keep between your responsibilities and self-care is an important theme today, so you need to make sure you're checking in with yourself often to avoid tiring yourself out. This gains further traction when an unbalanced aspect to unpredictable Uranus throws a wrench in our plans, leaving us scrambling to hold things together. Venus forms an off-putting aspect to hazy Neptune, and confusion could manifest in romantic partnerships as well. Keep your guard up against overly charismatic people right now, because there is a chance you could be taken for a ride if you fall too hard for charm over substance. Though the day may feel like it's filled with uncertainty, fluctuations in energy, and confusion, things clear up this evening when the moon shares a supportive connection to Mars. You'll likely feel motivated to work on a passion project or even spend a little one-on-one -on -one time under the sheets, but try not to stay up too late. A connection between the moon and Neptune could bring strange dreams your way tonight, but try not to read too much into them. Any messages that come through will likely be too convoluted to unpack. In the early morning, the moon trines Saturn in Libra, helping to regulate our instincts. Both Saturn and the Libra moon are oriented to justice, and in trying to each other, Saturn curbs the moon's affinity for ruminating over choices but failing to commit to one. At this time, we easily tackle responsibilities by determining urgency and priority. This aspect perfects while some of us are still asleep, so our dreams may aid us in making decisions, guiding us to obvious conclusions through symbolism. In waking life, we might receive sound advice from elders or bosses, those who have developed more experience having been, in the game, longer. At dawn, the moon opposes Chiron in Aries, stimulating self-doubt. We are likely to feel touchy or embarrassed, and from the current vantage point, all roads lead to failure. Why are we focusing on the negatives? Well, often it can be easier to relinquish control and have someone else make the difficult choices. That way, if situations go sideways, the blame can't fall back on us. Although we want to absolve ourselves of the decision-making process, we are not being allowed to get away with it now, which creates frustration and stress. This is a lesson in self-ownership. Yes, the threat of failure is unpleasant, but so is living a life that others have designed for you.